Aloha from Math Camp. I'm Dane, and this mini lesson is about constructing parabolas using GeoGebra in less than five minutes. I'm thinking you may get more out of this if you download a free copy of GeoGebra first. You will recall that a parabola is the set of all points that are equidistant from a point called the focus and a line called the directrix. So for example, this point is four and 15 hundredths, some kind of units, away from the focus and the same distance from the directrix. And if I slide along here and maintain the fact that those distances are the same, that, my friend, is a parabola. Now, I'm gonna show you how to construct this using GeoGebra. First of all, we will do a new file and we'll select graphing. I'm going to go up here in the upper right hand corner and turn off the axes and the grid just because I think it kind of gets in the way. And what I'm going to do is first of all select to draw a line and then a point. The point is C which is our focus because of course when things are in focus, you see better. Next, I will draw a perpendicular line to the given directrix. And that's my point D. Now, I will connect C and D with a segment. And then select perpendicular bisector of that segment. Then go up to your points again. I'm going to select intersect with the intersection of the two perpendiculars that I've come up with. That gives me point E. And now I want to create two segments. So I'll go to segment C, E, and E, D. And finally, I want to find the lengths of those segments. So if you go up to the top here where it's got this little angle and you select distance or length and just click on those two segments, you will see that the distance is the same because we're on the perpendicular bisector. All right. Next thing I want to do is I just want to get all the clutter out of here. So I'm going to right click on point A where it says show object. I just click on that. It's gone. I'm going to right click on this segment, same thing, show object is gone. This segment, show object, it's gone. Point B, show object, it's gone. And the perpendicular line here, show object, it's gone. Finally, I'm going to right click on E and where it says show trace, I'm going to click that. And go over here to the arrow, select the arrow. So now I'm going to drag point D. That is a parabola. 